Hi everyone, welcome back to Nettie's Down Under. Well, I just finished having my main meal with fish and vegetables and now I just heated up a nice apple pie for myself. See, nice one. Now the reason why I can handle it for because I only want it lukewarm. So what do you think I should have with it? Cream, got none. Ice cream, got some but I don't want to eat it. So I'm going to make custard my way. And I've been doing this way over 20 plus years. First of all, powder milk into my pot. Powder milk. Then I say to myself, well, let's get some custard powder. Custard powder. The reason why it's a nice expensive one, because it was given to me in a Christmas hamper. So... Nene, are you going to measure your custard powder? No, let's just go toss, toss, toss. Let's see. Hey, custard powder. That would do me. Then what else do you put with it, Nene? Custard sugar. Yes, it's a little bit more fine to eat. And you say to yourself, Nene, how much are you going to put in? I don't know. Here we go. Oh... Yep, that will do me. And most of all, the last ingredients you put in with it, second last ingredient, good old vanilla essence, is the invitation stuff. But it's just still as good as anything else. How much are you going to put into that, Nanette? I don't know. Here we go. That looks good, doesn't it, Nanette? Yes, it does. Rightio. So... You say yourself, then you just put milk powder, custard, custard sugar, vanilla essence. Then I say to myself, let's get some water. Just straight out of the pot. Then you say to yourself, what are you going to do next, Nanette? I say to myself, well, let's mix all that up into like a water type of paste type of thing. Look, I'll show you what I mean. So all I'm doing, I'll just bring it up a bit more, is I'm just stirring it. See this? And I want to make sure that everything is combined. So let's see what else I can find that might help. I might just add a little bit more water. Let's see what happens when I do that. Mm, should I, should I? Because it's only just me. I'll just add a little bit more. Yeah, I cook like an oddball, guys, don't you worry. Then I say to myself, Nanette, let's put it on the oven. I have a little portable gas oven. The reason I have one is because my stove costs a lot of bloody money to run. All right, let's get this started. Right here, let's pop it on the gas oven. Good I? Then I say to myself, let's bring everybody up. Watch me stir custard. So when you really think about it, everyone, is that no need to waste your good milk. Nah. Good way to use powder milk. I use powder milk for a lot of stuff. Don't you worry. I even drink it too. All right, let's go. All I'm waiting for now on this little gas stove of mine is I'm waiting that to warm up. And what happens as time goes on, Yep, it gets a little thicker. Not yet, not yet, but it will. But if you're lazy like some people, just buy the packet stuff, it's even cheaper. Chuck the damn thing in the microwave how much you want and you're fine. But no, not me. I like to, to bake it. Yep, it's starting to warm up. This little camp stove here actually came with my camp oven. And I really love it. I use a lot of this. I love cooking with gas, that's all. While this is nicely thickened up, I'll get back to you, okay, when it's done. Okay, folks, it's just thickened up. Look at that, nice and thick. Nice and thick, it's boiling on top. Now, if I really want to, okay, I'll just turn this off. Turn my gas off. Now, if I really want to, 
I could have got this custard a lot, lot more thicker for what we call in Australia vanilla slices. Now, the reason why you, your custard needs to be thick for vanilla slices so it can be together. So I'm just going to show you now what it looks like. My custard. That's not thick at all, is it? It's beautiful. Look at that. That is delicious. See? And it only took about six, seven minutes to make. So, I'm just going to get a label. Yep. And so you're thinking, what's a label in Australia? I'll show you what a label is. No, wrong dude. Let me see if I got the right dude. Nah, wrong dude. My gosh, Nanette. Let's see if we can find it again. That's not a label. No. That's a good one for a biscotti, but it's not what I'm looking for. No. Don't need a masher, do we? See? Groovy. Keep going, Nettie. You'll find the one you're looking for, lovey. I know we will. I know we will. Found it! I call this a label. It looks big. I know it does. So, back to the masterpiece, eh? So, there's that. So, let's grab some yummy custard. Mmm, 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 mmm. Pour it over my yummy apple pie. Mmm, 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 mmm. I know it looks a bit thick, but I like my custard like this. That's enough for you yet, Nettie? No. Another one. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Oh, look at this again. See how thick it's getting now it's cooling down? That will make bloody good vanilla slices. But you know what? So you know that these guys, I do eat it. Watch. Mmm, 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 yum. I do love my custard, and I do make it myself a lot because I find it's a lot cheaper to do. That's for sure. Do you know what? After I finish having that, I might all have a lot more. Life. <laughs> I know it sounds silly, doesn't it? All right, bottoms up. Let's have a nice little taste, though. Mmm. I better taste it. Okay. Mmm. Man, man, man. That is bloody nice, everyone. Anyway. Have a wonderful evening. A wonderful day. I'll catch you next time, alrighty. Hooray. Bye.